in this video i will explain how you can make a 2d logo from custom shapes and then convert this 2d logo to 3d using photoshop so let's get started hello guys welcome back to another interesting tutorial on graphics help in this video i will make a 2d logo from custom shapes and then i will apply some gradients and then i will convert the 2d logo to 3d using photoshop so open photoshop so open photoshop and press ctrl plus n i'm going to choose dimensions of 1280 by 720 and i'm going to keep the resolution to 72 i'm going to rename it to logo design okay i need to be clear so i would like to explain if you are going to make a logo for professional purposes then you have to keep the dimensions and resolution very high since i am doing it for educational purpose i am going to keep it very low since i will be converting this 2d logo to 3d if the dimensions or resolutions are very high then it is going to take too much time so that's why i'm keeping it low you have to be careful while creating a logo press ok select custom shape tool from here and i have installed a lot of these custom shapes i'm going to select this one i am holding shift to draw it proportionally if i leave shift that's how it is gonna work press and hold shift key to draw it proportionally drop it now i'm going to select a color from here this is there just this is just a random color I want to add a gradient on this layer double click on the right hand side of this layer to open layer style options then click gradient overlay I am going to choose this gradient then press ok I also like to add a stroke of size 2 and then press ok so I have got this basic shape of a 2d logo so I want to convert it to 3d so right click this layer and choose rasterize layer again right click and choose rasterize layer style so you have got this logo over here now right click and choose new 3d extrusion from selected layer this will switch to 3d from essentials now go to this 3d tab and click on this third option which is shape one extrusion material double click over here and choose a color of your choice I am going to choose this one press ok and then again come back to layer 0 right click this layer 0 and choose postcard now select both of these layers and press ctrl plus E to merge them now go to 3d and select uh, render so I have realized a lot of people were asking in the previous videos that rendering is taking too much time so I have concluded that rendering depends on two factors first one is the specifications of your PC and the second one is the resolution and dimensions of your image since I am doing it for educational purpose I have kept it low so you have to be careful while doing this so the rendering has been completed now right click this layer and select rasterize 3d so you have converted this to 3d now you can improve the appearance of this logo by adding some adjustment layers so i'm going to add brightness and contrast layer first of all to make it a little bit more brighter you can also increase the contrast if you want then again i'm going to add levels layer this levels layer is useful to increase the glow like this so drag this slider towards left and this slider towards right you can also add color balance layer to increase the yellowish or bluish color
now you can also add hue and saturation layer this is a basic layer which provides different versions of the same logo while only changing the value of this hue slider